4 to the power of x plus 6 to the power of x equals to 9 to the power of x. Solve for real values of x, which satisfies this equation. It came from IIT JWE sample paper. But I have also seen it shared on the internet with the catchphrase, you should be able to solve this. Pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. And when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. We'll get started by dividing each term by 4 to the power of x. The first term simplifies to be 1. The next term becomes 6 over 4 all raised to the power of x. And the third term becomes 9 over 4 all raised to x. And 6 over 4 is equivalent to 3 over 2. And we'll substitute that in. And 9 over 4 is equivalent to 3 over 2 the whole squared. The quantity squared, yes. And we'll substitute that in. Equals to 3 over 2 all raised to x. We now simplify 3 over 2 squared all raised to the power of x. This becomes 3 over 2 all raised to the power of 2x. Now make the substitution. 3 over 2 whole to the power of x equals u. If we square both sides of the equation, we get 3 over 2 whole to the power of 2x equals to u squared. We thus have a quadratic equation. 1 plus u equals u squared. As u is 3 over 2 whole to the power of x and u squared is 3 over 2 whole to the power of 2x. We'll move the terms to the right hand side. So we get 0 equals to u squared minus u minus 1. Since u is equal to 3 over 2 whole to the power of x, we need u is greater than 0. Because 3 over 2 whole to the power of x will be a positive term. We then use the quadratic formula and simplify. We get u equals to the golden ratio. 1 plus square root 5 all over 2. But we are not done yet. We want to solve for x. Since 3 over 2 whole to the power of x equals u, we want to solve for x by taking the natural log on both sides. So natural log of 3 over 2 whole to the power of x equals to natural log of u. We can then bring the exponent down and solve for x by dividing by the natural log of 3 over 2. We substitute it for u and we get our exact answer. x equals to natural log of the golden ratio divided by the natural log of 3 over 2. And this simplifies to be approximately 1.187. At first, the problem was quite intimidating. But with clever substitution, we found the golden answer. Thanks for making LK Logic one of the best channels on YouTube. As always, thanks for watching and thanks for your support.